In this video, we're going to take a look at the new text-based editing tools in Adobe Premiere Pro. So I'm in the import screen and I'm just going to import a project file of a podcast interview I've done. Now in the import settings, we can already go to the automatic transcription section and turn that on. And we have a couple options such as language detection or labeling separate speakers. And if I press create, it will create our new project. And in the text window, which if you don't see that, should go to window text, it will automatically start transcribing our footage. Also, if you didn't automatically transcribe upon import, you could also just choose to begin transcribing from this text window. Once your footage finishes transcribing, you should see in the text window a full text transcription of your entire clip or whatever you chose. And the great part about this now is we can begin editing or searching through our footage as if it was a text document. So if I want to delete, let's say this part in the middle, just this sentence, I didn't like it or this question, we want to remove it. I can highlight as much as I want. I can simply press delete or I can copy and paste or lift and extract. And you'll see on my actual timeline, a cut was created there and it was deleted. So I'll press command Z to undo. Like I said, you can also lift, which will just lift that segment out or extract with this button and that'll lift it as well as close the gap. And then if I want to rearrange things, I can paste that later or paste it into a different section. So this could be especially useful if you're searching for a particular segment of the clip to post a highlight or a short. You can just search through the document and find it like that. Uh, there's also some really cool features that some of them are still in beta and still improvements coming. But if you ever see these dot, dot, dots, these are pauses. You can also look for filler words like um or uh, and you can choose what to do with them. So I can delete them and I can delete all of them or just delete some of them or just go look at them just to see if that's a pause that I want or I want to remove. And also if there's ever, let's say, for example, it doesn't recognize my last name. And I can always just search for any time. Let's just change this to text. I can search for any time that it, it misspells my last name. And I can just press replace and replace it with my proper spelling of my last name and press re replace or replace all. And you might wonder what's the point of doing that. It doesn't change anything about what's actually being said. But the next really useful and cool thing is we can create captions from our transcription automatically. So if I press the Create Captions button, you can choose the options about your caption and preferences about like the line and character length, how, how often to split the line. And if I press Create Caption now, it'll create a caption track above my tracks, clip by clip that I can go through and highlight. So you can see it's automatically writing the captions there, which is something that might have taken hours to do by hand we're doing it in the click of a button and it's pretty good. And we can fix those spelling errors with the replace, like I said, so it's getting my name right because I just fixed it one time. And you can also highlight any of these clips, go to the essential graphics panel and click edit. So you can highlight the text. And if you want to use a different font or size, you can do that as well. So this is just making life a lot easier for these sort of footages, talking head or interview style clips. So my name is Justin Odisho. If you enjoyed this video, you can subscribe to stay tuned for all of my future videos and check out hundreds of more on the playlist on my channel. And also, if you're interested in actually listening to this interview I did a few years back with fellow YouTube creator Daniel Schiffer, then I do have a podcast with several dozens of episodes that you can find on my channel in the playlist Justin Odisho podcast. So thanks so much for watching and I'll see you in the next videos.